Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Unfortunately, today we might get demonetized because we're talking about guns. Oh wait, I'm not even monetized and I talk about guns in literally every video. So I think we're good here. But today we're going to be talking about a gun that I very rarely use and that's a mid-tier weapon that I think is underrepresented so today we're going to be talking about the ppsh the ppsh has some of the most amazing specs i've ever seen and then there's this one one spec that just ruins the whole gun looking at this weapon it has very limited amount of customizations you can add so essentially you can only add a flashlight and a sight so the sight on this weapon is really nice i really like the sight or uh, the original sight anyway so i don't plan to really put a sight on here but i have a flashlight on here and that really doesn't boost much specs anyways you only get a one percent boost in damage and a seven time a seven percent or one point boost in damage and a seven point boost in accuracy accuracy is pretty decent um fire rate is really nice uh holder is absolutely amazing total ammo is nice as well but then you have the damage man this this damage is just killing me right here you need five shots to the body to an opponent who doesn't even have armor on to get a kill now that sounds absolutely horrid but looking at the fire rate you can literally get that kill in half of a second this weapon fires 10 rounds in one second which means with five rounds to the body you could get a kill in about half a second if a person has the armor on you could get a kill in about a second one thing i dislike about this weapon is you do need like a bunch of shots to get the kill for a person wearing the exoskeleton shoot the suit you could get you require like up to eight shots to the body to get a kill and that does seem pretty damn terrible so let's take this gun into a game see how it actually performs see if we like it or not uh i think i'll like the accuracy i'll like i love every other spec of this weapon aside from the aside from the damage the damage is just it's just the reason i don't use this weapon anymore um but the accuracy absolutely amazing this weapon is one of the most one of the more accurate weapons over longer distances and that's why it still is in the game a little bit it's barely holding on uh in the assault weapon category i very rarely pe see people using it but some people use it and are amazing with it i'm surprised that some people do perform so amazingly with it but what i'm not surprised about is the accuracy the combination of accuracy fire rate and large magazine you could get up to like seven kills before having to reload seven maybe even ten if you are really good at aiming uh and you do get a lot of headshots so let's go right in we have a massive massive drum a drum and the skin on this weapon is absolutely beautiful as well we might struggle a little bit with this map because this weapon is more of a longer distance map since it's more accurate uh and it's a bit quick damage isn't amazing so if you come up against like a one hit kill weapon this weapon's probably not going to perform as amazingly as you would like one thing i uh also dislike about this weapon is you really don't have an option for customizations and that really does kill this weapon the option for a trunk would be absolutely phenomenal on this weapon if you could equip a trunk on here it would make this weapon so much better even if the damage was up to like 25 by four points or something like that this weapon would be in a whole new category but since this damage is so so low uh it does take quite a while to get a kill i don't know why there's a three round burst thing going on but as you saw right there shot the guy with the exoskeleton about seven times and uh really didn't get the kill we only got the assist there so a couple of shots there a lot of headshots and we finally finally got the kill there as well so oh that was about five shots to the head but i think there's a bit of a delay since this weapon is so quick as you could see absolutely amazing sight though five time kill streak weapon is amazing at damage but it is amazing every other where so you could still get really really nice kills here might take a little bit of time to get that kill but over longer distance is really accurate so if you're looking for a decent mid-tier weapon i would recommend this weapon but i definitely still think there are better options so this weapon wouldn't be my first recommendation for mid-tier players i would probably recommend a weapon like the um ump over this weapon just because its damage is just so much better uh it's, the ump's damage is about 27 20 nine correct me if i'm wrong i'm pretty sure i'm in the ballpark though um so i would recommend the ump over this weapon but if you just want uh, a weapon that you want to test out over mid distances that you feel is accurate this weapon does perform pretty well uh 
And that's about all I could say for this weapon. I'm really trying to be uh, positive about this weapon, and I do love it sometimes, but the damage is just way too low for me, man. Um... I, I don't know, maybe if this weapon got a 4 hit kill rather than a 5, 6 hit kill, it would be better, it'd be more comparable to weapons like the UMP or the SIG, um, but weapons like this, the P90, uh, and the, um, and the MAC-10 are absolutely destroyed because their damage is so low. And that just goes to show you that even if a weapon has absolutely amazing stats everywhere else and one stat is absolutely terrible, it could absolutely wreck the gun. Uh, as you saw there, once again, like 10 shots to the exoskeleton guy, still no kill. So, um... Let's try to get in there, try to get the kill there. Wow, nice kill with the AK-7 RPK. Uh, I almost said AK-74. But nice kill with the RPK. He got like two headshots, and I had no chance with this weapon. But yeah, guys, um, I would say this gun's pretty mediocre. It has the potential to be better. I hope it gets a little bit... Uh, mm. I hope it gets a little bit amended to perform a little bit better uh, and the damage gets boosted by a couple points at least. Um, but other than that, guys, I would not recommend this weapon if you are looking for the best weapon to have. It's an amazing addition to have if you're just looking for another weapon to add to your arsenal. But if you are trying to wait, uh, save money and you are trying to get the best bang for your buck, I would have to recommend a weapon like the SIG or the UMP over this weapon. But yeah, guys, that is the video. If you want, keep watching. Watching, and I hope you enjoyed this killing here. We're not doing super amazing, but um, I would also like to say if you're bored at home and you are conflicted between a couple weapons you want to buy, uh, I go check out my videos. I'm sure I have a video in there telling you which weapon is better, which weapon has better specs, and advising you to buy the best thing for your buck. I know it is hard to earn money in this game. You need to play like 25, 50 games to have enough money to buy a weapon, so I want you to have the best weapon you can for your money and provide you the best bang for your buck so if you're conflicted between two weapons like the m4 or the ak uh, i definitely have videos highlighting the positives and negatives of each weapon so definitely go check that out if you just want to check out a weapon that you like uh, and see if it's worth it before you buy it i would highly recommend watching my videos i think they'll help you out a lot but yeah guys that was the video if you liked it definitely hit that thumbs up button if you like this type of content in general hit that subscribe button as well well as the post notification bell to stay updated and you will be the first to get the best weapon but other than that guys i will let you go thank you once again for watching and i hope you have an amazing day